Hi, my name is Kate Farrar. I'm the Chief Executive Officer of LGIA Super. Now that we're into the new financial year, we've had a bit of time to think about what happened last financial year, and it's that that I'd like to talk to you about today. So, last financial year was best described, I think, as a year of two very different halves. Prior to Christmas, there was an awful lot of volatility, uncertainty, returns fell. But after Christmas, we had incredibly strong performance across a lot of different markets and across a lot of LGI Super's investment options. Well, when the markets fall, obviously whole portfolios fall and the short term returns did reflect the volatility that we saw across all of the markets. But over time, as you would expect, LGI Super's strong, long term diversified approach to running our portfolios meant that we saw some really good returns across our portfolios and in particular to the investment option which is our default option, our diversified growth. LGI Super uses diversification as the key way of managing risk and one of our um, special advisors on our investment committee uh, often says that diversification is the only free lunch uh, in markets. So what it does is it means that if this asset goes down, you've got a balancing asset over here that doesn't go down. And so the impact on the portfolio of a single big change to equity markets, for example, is dampened. So what you can see on the screen at the moment uh, is our end of financial year results. So we would, they're just in, it's a bit of a news flash for us now. Um, to put them in really simple terms, what they mean is that for a member who had $100,000 in their balance as at 1 July 2014, they would have had $144,000 in their balance at the end of last financial year. And that is just working on the compounding of the returns that we've delivered. It doesn't include any additional contributions by members. So really it just shows the power of keeping your money invested over time. So some of the things that we do differently at LGI Super when we're looking at our members' portfolios are, for example, we've talked about diversification. We have quite a heavy weighting to international assets because it gives you a lot more options in terms of being able to invest in different companies. And that's really delivered fantastic performance over the last year. Another thing that we do a little bit differently is to invest in local government assets around Australia and, and also internationally because we think that those mid-market assets are ones where we can really take control of the asset and make real difference to the returns for members. So we do have a heavy weighting at LGIS Super, particularly in our diversified growth portfolio, uh, towards infrastructure and property because we really like the consistency and solidity um, of real assets. And infrastructure was in fact our best performing asset class over the last financial year, delivering 11% returns. We've also had really good results from our international equities, which delivered well above benchmark. We think that's the result of some of the great partnerships that we've developed through our process of picking fantastic managers around the world. So for example, um, we have Morgan Stanley working with us to help us get exposure to uh, emerging markets like China, India, Korea, and over the last financial year, they delivered 14% to members, which is just brilliant. Another terrific partnership that we have is with Sustainable Growth Advisors, which is a boutique stock picking firm in the United States. And their fantastic process of choosing stocks around the world delivered 20% return to members last year. So we're very pleased with the performance, some really solid results being generated. Uh, and they're continuing actually uh, over the last calendar year, for example, in our diversified growth portfolio, we've delivered 11% to members, which is fantastic. Our portfolio, as you would expect, has a range of really great high performing assets, but some of them are a little bit surprising. So one of our more interesting uh, assets is a citrus farm actually in Mildura, it's called Mildura Citrus and we think over time that that farm will transition to growing more and better citrus for export and also for domestic consumption but even so far it's been an amazing asset, it's delivered 20% since we bought it in April 2017. We always love talking to members about our investment portfolio. We're very passionate about it. Uh, if members want to find out more, they can go to our website on lgisuper.com.au forward slash investments, 
or they can call our call centre on 1800 444 Looking forward to another financial year where we can build on the great results of last year and deliver the best possible retirement outcomes for all of our members.